Hello everybody, it's me, Skull Queen. Welcome to day 21 of our challenge where I'm designing an entire island without Nintendo Online in 30 days. Now you're probably wondering, what the hell? Where are the cherry blossom trees? What is happening? And let me tell you, so, I've already been playing for like two and a half hours today. Last time I saw you guys, we were on April 1st. Do you guys see that date in the bottom left? We are on May 23rd and I went day by day painstakingly trying to find a freaking heavy meteor shower and I never found one, not once. Luckily though, I did find this day which has a light meteor shower so we should be seeing stars periodically. And as I was time traveling day by day, going crazy, about to throw my switch away, I happened to see a little thought bubble on our residential evil biatch, Zoe. And as soon as I saw that thought bubble on Zoe, I went sprinting to her. I said, adios, see you later. Here's a little pic of me saying goodbye because it was just such a beautiful moment. I had to capture it. So we're on this day, so the plot doesn't autofill. Hopefully we see some shooting stars going by and we're gonna go on a little mini villager hunt, which is actually really exciting because that means we'll have all 10 of our villagers that are gonna be finalized for the island. Do not mind my house, you guys. It's insane. I have these gyroids here to drop off. Oh great, she knows over. How much fun. Anyways, as I was saying, after we got Audi, I had the one ticket left because, you know, I farmed for two tickets, only needed one. And at the time when I was trying to put it away, I knew that my storage was completely full. And it actually let me put the ticket away. So I was like, what? Do I already have Nook Miles tickets? And apparently I already had five in my inventory. When did I get these tickets? I must have completely forgot about them. I don't know. I have no idea how those five got there. So those five that were there previously, plus the one I had extra, we're just gonna grab these six tickets. Thank God I don't have to farm for miles again. I really don't know where those five came from. I must have redeemed miles for one of the beginning villager hunts and just forgot about them. I have no idea, but it worked out because now we have six tickets. We're gonna go ahead and start our hunt. And you guys, since I've already been playing for hours today, trying to find freaking shooting stars, I really don't know how much I have left in me to do some huge extravagant build. So after we find our villager, I seriously might just terraform and call it there. Ugh, I don't know. I really, really wanted a lot of celestial items crafted for this island, but we might have to rethink it because honestly, you guys, I don't know how much I have left in me to just go farming like this over and over again with just so much disappointment. But let's go ahead and head to our first island. Okay, first island, who do we have? Oh, it's a freaking gorilla with his butt showing. Ah, oh, that's great. I don't even think I've seen that gorilla before. Have no idea what their name is and do not care. We're gonna go ahead and head to the next island. Island number two. Who is this? Oh, didn't we see him? Coach, right? Yeah, Coach. He is cute, just not with the yellow. I wish he was a different color. All right, let's head to island number three. All right. Oh no, who is that? Are you serious? Oh, I am not even going up there. And not even a DIY? Yeah, island number four, let's go. Okay, number four, and please be somebody good. Oh no. Oh wait, is that Hazel? <gasps> is that Hazel, is that Hazel, is that Hazel? Oh my God, oh my God, oh God. Yes, it's her! We got Hazel! I seriously thought this was like Sheldon or something again. <laughs> Whoops. She is so cute. I've never had Hazel on an island. Oh my god. Get away to my island. She's so cute. Look at her little unibrow. What the heck? How? How did we get Hazel? That is so lucky. Yay, I am so, so happy. We finally have our complete lineup of villagers. No more villager hunting. No more trying to kick anybody out. Super happy about that. So let's go ahead and head home. Wow, it got a lot darker on the island. I just have to make sure it's real though. Let's go and check the plot. There she is! Oh, and we're gonna be neighbors! So, so cute. 
And we still have two Nook Miles tickets. So if we get desperate enough for bells, we can always just sell those. As you can see though, I was checking Nooks each day I signed in just to make sure. Still no wheat fields, unfortunately, but was collecting some random items. And basically the island is back in disarray, but when isn't it, honestly? Another good thing about signing in for so many days is that we actually did get some help on our bridge. They have 25,000 in donations, that's a lot. So that's pretty good. I guess I'll help out. I'll put in 50 right now. So I guess we can move on to our plans for the day, which honestly is not gonna be that much. Sorry guys, this is gonna be kind of a shorter video just because I've already been playing so much off camera. But basically what I'm gonna do is clear out all of these trees behind resident services and Nook's Cranny and we're gonna start terraforming back here. I could have swore there were shooting stars when I was signed in earlier and I haven't seen one yet. What the hell? My game is like glitched out for these meteor showers. I don't know what the hell is happening. But I just picked up the orange trees and the rest of these trees, I'm just gonna start chopping down. Oh no. Oh God, run, 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 run. Every time my heart drops. Okay, we got the area all cleared up. I'm gonna open up the Island Designer app and we'll start with this cliffscaping. Here's the shooting stars, yes. Okay, so we have this main level done. I'm just gonna climb up here and we'll start working on some second tier cliffs. All right, so we have something like this. I think I'm gonna turn this cliff right here into a little stargazing slash lookout area. Over here, we'll probably just do waterfalls and then this whole middle section right here, I think I'm gonna turn into like a little picnic spot. So that's just like my brainstorming going into it. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the waterscaping tool and we'll start with our little waterfalls. Okay, pretty cute. And I think at the bottom here, we're just gonna add like a little pond or something. Just a cute little pond like this. I think that will be just fine. Plus we still have to leave some room for a little pathway to cross right in front. So I'm happy with that shape. I just wanna add the actual picnic blanket and see where that's gonna go. Here is our little picnic blanket. So, so cute. 
by the way, when I was time traveling over and over and over again, planted a bunch more money trees, so that'll help out. But I'm gonna go ahead and time travel to tomorrow so we can meet Hazel and collect our little star fragments. We have Hazel, yay. And if we happened to have an actual meteor shower tonight, I would cry. Doesn't look like we're going to. But let's go say hi. Oh, her little house is so cute. Aw, hi, baby Hazel. You and your unibrow are gonna be thriving here on Basic Witch. So happy to have you. And I don't know if you guys have noticed, but daily routine is going out the window today. My brain just cannot handle it right now. <laughs> But I'm just gonna go around my beaches and see, oh look, star fragments, yes. Oh my God, we need these. I really hope I got another large one. <gasps> a large one, yes, we needed that. Looks like we got a Gemini fragment too. That's really exciting. We finally have a cacao tree, yes. <laughs> ah! Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. What? Where the hell did that thing come from? Holy F, and I have the freaking net in my hand. <sighs> my heart rate just spiked. Okay, I'm just gonna do one more lap around the beaches and see if any other fragments spawned. I doubt it though, because I really didn't wish on too many stars yesterday because it wasn't a freaking meteor shower. I need a heavy one, not a light one. I don't know why it's taking so long to get one too. I even went back to the original day that I had the meteor shower back in 2023. It was April 8th. I even went back and watched my own video for reference. Then I went back to that exact day in the game and there was nothing. I'm like, what the F? Yep, I'm not seeing any more star fragments spawning. So in total today, we got one Gemini fragment, seven regular star fragments, and one large star fragment. That sounds about right. I don't think I wished on more than like nine or 10 stars. So I think I'm gonna call it there. Sorry, it was a shorter video, you guys. My mental capacity has just been drained today with the literally 24 days of in-game play that I've been time traveling through one by one. I was even going all the way into the game and just looking at the sky because Isabel can ignore the messaging of a large meteor shower being on the island if there happens to be some other news like a campsite villager or somebody moving in or out. So I was signing all the way in and looking at the sky to make sure there was no meteor shower before going to the next day each and every time as well as going into Nook's Cranny and planting the money tree if I saw it. So it's been a lot of Animal Crossing today. I really don't know what I'm gonna do if I can't find a heavy meteor shower day. I might try one more time, but if I can't do that and find it, you guys, I don't know if I have it in me to keep going. We might just have to work with what we have. And I really wanted like some crescent moon chairs and the actual moon item, but they take so many fragments and we're just not getting that many. So we'll see if I play offline tonight, then I will let you guys know for tomorrow's episode. But I think I'm gonna wrap up today's right here. All right, everyone, that's gonna do it for today's video. Thank you for sticking with me through the chaoticness of it all. But if you'd like to see day 22 posted tomorrow, then be sure to subscribe and I will see you all then. Bye.